Right now, we got the E. Jado project going on with the, it says HR, but it says HS Steel Single Speed Conversion Kit Jado, right? Let me make sure you guys got that. I know that light is like... Crazy bright with that white. I don't know. I'll put the link in the description because right now I can't even see it. I'm looking in the camera right now. So if you can see it from there. Yeah, let me zoom in. That fucking light is just killing me. All right, I'll get you guys afterwards, all right? All right. <clears throat> in the meantime... We're going to rock out. Um, just got my music on shuffle right now. Trying to get my head together. You know. All right. So basically what we got here is one. If you can see that one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. You probably about probably got about nine screws in here just until you can so you can go like this first. So everybody thinking that they just gonna pull this apart once they get those screws at the bottom done. Don't let this fool you. Cause you got if you can see through there, you got one there one there this right here was for the battery tray when you had it as nitro but right now we don't have nitro and one more thing guys when you pull your diff apart on your jado remember how it goes in because um i i had a little bit of problem getting this back in only because i forgot how i took it out but thank god it's rusty there and you see the rust there so i just followed the rust pattern that's how I figured it out. All right. Now that we got that out, uh, we just pull this apart. Try to be careful, which me, I'm not going to be careful because I'm throwing all of these gears in the garbage because I'm not using these no more. These are the old ones. I'm not using them because it's a problem. I mean, they're bad. Well, they, it is bad. That's the reason why I, I ordered the, um, the new steel HR gears. Because I tried to do the lock the diff like everybody else. And you can see I cracked it there and ran the screw too far through it there. And I did the same thing here, but it didn't come out too bad, right? So when I put it all back together, I noticed the sound. It sounded crunchy like it wasn't working right, like I didn't do the conversion right. So I just said, you know what? The hell with it. Sorry about that. I said the hell with it. I'm going to just take it apart, throw it to the side, and order the steel gears, right? 20 and 15, right? So as I did that, I started searching, um, you know, YouTube, trying to figure out a solution or see if anybody had a video out on how to put this back together well as you can see there is no video that's why I'm making this video so this is trial and error right here so basically what I'm doing it'll be my first time and your first time seeing it and first time being done um I'm gonna check the video in a minute to make sure that I'm not going over my time because YouTube been cutting me on my time. I don't know why. I guess I got to give them my number, but I can't do that. That's crazy. I'm not giving nobody my number on the internet, but that's another story. So, um, 
Well, to tell you the truth, I should have watched how I had that in here. So we're going to do it like this because it went in there like that, I think. All right, people, I'm sorry about that. I kind of got thrown off real quick because I was wondering where the other piece was at, so I had to look around. I wasn't going to say it on camera. You know what I mean? Trying to thug it out. So basically, this part right here was down in here like this. I pulled that out, tossed that to the side because it's plastic. Stick this back in here. Let me bring these over here so you can see. You take this and you slide that down there like that, right? This right here. Goes like this. You grab this right here. If I can get it. Put that up there like that. Yeah, you put that up there like that, people. And um, you slide this part right here down on the top of it, right? Now, once you do that, it should line up the hole. Right? Let me make sure. Alright, right. So I slide this down so I can see that hole. Once I see that hole, I grab this grub screw here. I take the Allen wrench, if this is the right one. And I tighten that down in there. Let me see if I can do it. Trial and error, people. Trial and error. All right. So I got it in there. I need to tighten it down. Yo, most. I didn't give these niggas a freestyle in mad long, man. Since last year. I got I to gotta bring the air right, man. All right. I need something it's, I can speak my mind on, man. Crazy. These niggas think I'm playing with them this year. Give me, give me a beat, man. I need, I need, I need a Brooklyn feel, man. I need something I can really spit some bars to. Something I can go off on. No smooth shit. I'm talking about really go off. You got something for me, bro? Put some shit on, man. Put some shit on. Let me, let me see what you got. All right. This is supposed to be the screw. The grub screw. But it's not working. So, I'm going to go with the original one that I had in it already in a Jado. I'm gonna see if it goes in all the way. Alright. It's not supposed to go in all the way like that. So I'm gonna take this one out. And I'm gonna try this other one again. You know what? Hold that there like that. I'm gonna stick this in here now. Like that. All right, so it's not even the correct one. So let me grab this. Excuse the music, people. It's on random. Don't mean to offend anybody out there that, that don't listen to that type of music. I really wasn't going to make this video, but I see... There might be somebody out there like me who need this help, so I decided to make the video. Alright, 
All right, so basically I'm holding this here until I can find the hole. All right, look like I found the hole. I'm gonna shove it in. That's what she said. And then I'm gonna drill it out. That's what she said. All right, it's working. It's drilling in. It's going in nice and easy and tight. That's what she said. All right. I wanna make sure I get this grub screw tight. Notice I ain't use no Loctite. Not a fan of that. But then I gotta start burning shit and lighting shit on fire. So say I, I got the Loctite in here, right? And I need to heat this up. I got a chance of burning my plastic. Now I got to go buy new plastic all over again. I'm not doing that. That's insane. You know what I mean? All right, I'm about to cut the video and do another one because my video is running kind of short.